Hey, good computer. What's up, Chloe? Well, I just finished writing this paper and it's like four pages. It's going to take me forever to type. Why don't you type a little at a time? How? Take a look at this. Hey kids, it's your old pal QWERTY back to talk about saving your documents. Whenever you are typing a paper or doing any kind of work on the computer in a program like Microsoft Office Word, it's important that you save your work. Here's how. Mike is typing a paper on Monday about coyotes when his teacher says it's time to go. Because Mike is working in Word 2007, he will need to go to the Office button in the top left hand corner. Click and select Save from the drop down menu. Because it is his first time saving, Mike is asked to give the file a name. He decides to call it Coyotes. Simple enough. That's great, but here's the cool part about saving your work. Now it's Wednesday, two days later, and when Mike goes to the Office button, he can click on his recent documents, find Coyotes, and all of his work is still there. Mike can pick up right where he left off on Monday. Many students question save versus save as. You can use save as to change the file type or to create a copy of a document. Check with your teacher before doing so. So when you save your work, you can pick up right where you left off, huh? Yep, and you can use save as to create different file types or make copies of your work in different locations. Cool, well I guess I better get started typing this paper. What's the title of your paper? How to bake the world's best chocolate chip cookies. Did you say cookies? Mm -hmm.